Wellness, I'm Grant from Lathwaite. Now a lot of us are finding ourselves a little more time on our hands than usual at the moment. We might be looking for ways to keep ourselves occupied and entertained. We're learning about wine in the comfort of our own homes and then sharing that experience with friends and family certainly fits the bill. And of course you can get the whole wonderful world of wine delivered to your doorstep. So here's a short video with my tips on hosting your own virtual wine tasting. Firstly, your kit. A couple of glasses per person would be ideal, as would a couple of different bottles of wine. Some crackers to help keep your palate uh, nice and clean, as well as some water to stay hydrated. Themes. When thinking about themes, the most important thing I could say is choose something that you're really enthusiastic about. Something that you love can really give life to your tasting. And that might be a particular wine region, choosing two wines from a region, or your favorite grape variety. Choose two different examples from different regions or even different countries. You might have a particular producer that you like, or a style of wine you may want to do David versus Goliath. So a less expensive wine versus a more expensive wine. Plan ahead. Planning ahead will allow everyone to order their wines and get them delivered and give you some time for the anticipation to build around your tasting. It will also give you time to do your research. So download your tasting notes from the Lathwaite's website. Go to producer website for some more, for some more information. We'll get onto Google, look at the region and the grape variety. Support your tasting with photos. The picture paints a thousand words. Also, some stories, some history, and some facts. Think a little bit about the order in which you're gonna show your wines. So a light wine before a heavier wine, a white before red, less expensive before more expensive, and then dry before sweet. Pick whichever one of those you think is the most relevant. So on to the night of the tasting itself. When everyone's logged in, Welcome your guests. Get them tasting and enjoying their wines as soon as you can. Introduce your theme and tell a story. Taste the wines. Now, if you're gonna taste the wines with some food, try them without food first and then with food later. Get everyone to look at the appearance of the wine, the nose, and then the palate. And if you're going to include food, which I'd recommend, it'll give another dimension to your tasting. Just remember what grows together, goes together. Make your tasting as interactive as you possibly can. So get people to volunteer their opinions about the wine, their tasting notes if they like, and then say their scores uh, out of 10. Be honest and enthusiastic, but most of all, enjoy your wines. Now there's some further information uh, on this webpage with some links which you might find helpful for setting up your own virtual wine, uh, wine tasting. Thanks for joining me, cheers.